Mummy Pig and Daddy Pig are taking Pepper and George for a ride in a hot air balloon. Hello, Pepper. Hello, George. Hello, Miss Rabbit. That's a very big balloon you've got there. Why, thank you, Pepper. But it's not just any balloon, it's a hot air balloon. Why doesn't it just float away? <laughs> well, we need to fill it with hot air first. Also, I've tied it to the ground just in case. Well, it all looks very exciting. Shall we go for a ride then? Yes, please. It's a very hot day. I think we should all wear our hats to help protect us from the sun. <laughs> Excellent! All aboard! It's a little bit cramped in here. Everybody ready? Here we go! Why isn't it going up, Miss Rabbit? I don't know. When I pull this handle, it usually makes the hot air balloon go up. I know, you forgot to untie the balloon from the ground. Oh yes, that's right. Don't worry, I'll untie it for you. There we go. Hurry Daddy Pig, the hot air balloon is leaving without you. Wait for me. Here we go. Up, up and away. Careful, Pepper. It's a long way down. Everything looks so small from up here. I think I can see our car from up here. Wow! And look, there's our house. <laughs> oh, hello there. <laughs> I think it thinks you're a tree, Daddy. Its wings must be very tired to have flown all the way up here. Oh dear, where did my hat go? <laughs> Daddy, the little bird knocked your hat off your head. Oh dear, Daddy Pig's head isn't protected from the sun anymore. Don't worry Daddy Pig, your hat won't have gone far. Down we go. Hmm, I was sure your hat would be around here somewhere. There it is, your hat stuck in that tree. I'm not quite tall enough to reach it. Thank you, little bird. Thank you, Peppa. Thanks for taking us up in your hot air balloon, Miss Rabbit. I'm glad you enjoyed it, Peppa. Everyone had quite an adventure, didn't they? Yes. Especially Daddy's hat! <laughs>